Hello, this is TenorTech, and today I'm going to show you a solenoid engine. So this solenoid engine consists of this electromagnetic solenoid that I scrapped from an old printer, and a few bent paper clips, a fan, and my flywheel that I made out of an old top, a few pennies, and an alligator clip. It is on a frame made of wood, popsicle sticks, and nails. I am running it off 18.4 volts, which is all my variable power supply can provide. So how this works is when the magnetic pin of the solenoid is fully extended, it, this will turn and touch the switch that will activate the magnetic solenoid, which will then pull the piston in and as soon as it is fully pulled in, the switch will not be touching. The magnetic solenoid will turn off, and the momentum will keep pushing this forward until it again touches the switch, which will activate the magnetic solenoid. This cycle will go on and on until the power is stopped or something gets in the way of one of the fans. So, I made this switch by using one wire that was stripped and flayed as a brush touching the drive shaft as one pull of the switch. And as the other pull, I used just a piece of bare copper wire. So when it moves and the bend in the drive shaft touches the bare copper wire, it will complete the circuit and activate the switch. I had to put an alligator clip on one end of the flywheel. Otherwise, this solenoid engine would not work. This is the solenoid engine running. It does not move very fast, and I cannot figure out how to make it go faster. Thank you for watching!